Hey guys and welcome back. Charles Damiano here from the Bruce Lee Collection for another exciting episode of Bruce Lee Show and Tell. Now this week what we're going to do is we're going to feature one of my Bruce Lee friends out of South Carolina. His name is Harry McKenzie. Now Harry, after seeing Dave Love's top 10 Bruce Lee collectibles, wanted to do something a little different. He wanted to feature his Bruce Lee Nucleus collection. Now for those of you who don't know, in the late 90s, Linda Lee and Shannon Lee came out with the Bruce Lee and Brandon Lee Memorial Banquets. memorabilia, uh, probably skyrocketed by John Little, who put out a lot of books and wrote all the magazines and newsletters for the Lee family at the time, and they came out with these beautiful Bruce Lee newsletters, uh, magazines, which a lot of you have probably seen before, and which now are very, very hard to get. And in this episode, we're going to feature Harry McKenzie's Nucleus Collection. So this is going to be a really exciting episode. You're going to see newsletters, magazines, pins, business cards, signatures from all of Bruce Lee's first generation students, and many, many more things that Harry was able to put together, and which you guys will see today in a beautiful picture gallery played to music. So for now, let's take a glimpse into Harry McKenzie's beautiful Bruce Lee Nucleus Collection. Enjoy.
Welcome back, guys. I hope you enjoyed a glimpse into Harry McKenzie's Bruce Lee Nucleus Collection. What an amazing collection Harry just shared with us. And I want to first off thank Harry for sharing his Nucleus Collection with the fans and other collectors out there. So please, guys, write in. Let Harry hear from you. Let him know how much you enjoyed seeing his collectibles. Let him hear from you in the comments. Uh, let him know what you thought of his collection. And again, guys, until next time, Charles Damiano signing off from the Bruce Lee Collection saying, have fun collecting.